to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. The teams then, Borussia Dortmund against Augsburg. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. I've been hit by it too. can get it clear Lucas Piszczek looks to thread it through Suchi gets it away chance to shoot Chan that is wayward well in the circumstances I think he did well to get some sort of attempt on goal because he was pretty much hurried and hassled out of that well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. Schmelzer. Royce. Going full steam down the flank. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Goes for goal! It's a carbon copy of their previous miss. Well, when you see chance after chance go astray like that, it's only natural to think that they may end up with a little regret here. I just really like the way they've started with such intensity, Peter. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Spoon forward. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? They're still going. Where to next? Thrust towards the front line. That's not going to make it. Akanji plays a clever pass. Point blank header! Great ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. Oh, that was a lovely little dink over the top just to get the runner in on the keeper. And what a pity he just couldn't produce a goal from that. Lafonge goes for the cross. And back out it comes. And it's Chan. It's the channel. Decent enough try. That's not the ball he wanted. And the first half is done. So we reach the halfway point. Borussia Dortmund ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment and that has to be maintained in the second half. So they head in no further forward. The score here still 0-0. 
Borussia Dortmund clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Drives it towards the front. Schmelzer does well there, alert. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind, but the runners from midfield too. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Schmelzer. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and what they've got to realise, Peter, is that they won't get away with excessive force for long, so they're running a fine line now. Romero with a shot! They've scored! There is the breakthrough! With time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Well, I think the keeper has every reason to rip into that defence for allowing him to get into such a good position. Borussia Dortmund get themselves into the lead. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. Lefondre. Play for a throw. It's a good-looking cross. Berkey can hoist it clear. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. And he's there to cut it out. Keeper's got good distance on that. Suchi. Augsburg have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. What a throw in. Spreads it wide. Away from immediate danger. Akanji. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Tried to play it through. I timed this run brilliantly and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Cuts it out. Schmelzer. Royce. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. 